okay so in this part we are going to learn the button click button click event handling so just hit the start a new Android project and I'm going to name this project my button event click handling so my its name is quite long but it's for learning purpose so it doesn't matter so click next and then click next and then click empty activity and then click finish so the our application uh, sorry our project is building and you can see see our main activity dot java file and activity dot main file so it is loading still and here it loads completely so the first thing that I want to do is I want to delete this text so hit delete and I want to drag a button here and going to name and uh, write the text inside as Android and um, and leave the button ID as button itself so now I want to go to the main.activity.java file so and I'm going to create a the variable called button and it is showing the error on to just type all plus enter so every time you you write something new here you have to import the class so in order to save our time so I want you to go to the file and then setting and then editor um, wait a minute editor and then auto import and then click this checkbox and ok now it is automatically going to import all of those necessary class that we need at runtime now I want to have a reference on this on, on this newly created button so you, 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 all, you all you need to do uh, for this is just type find view id r dot id dot and our button id is button itself and now the same color. and now it is saying some error just type all plus enter and cast to android dot widget dot button hit enter so our problem will be solved now what I want to do in this project is that whenever I click this button I I want to show some toast um, in this side in the, in the bottom of my Android screen. So for this, I can mm, I can set the on click listener on button as like this set button the set on click listener, and then all you need to do is hit it and just type new and then button button and then side this after this you need to you need to you need to do on click listener and then implement all of its message and then implement so and then just like this and just uh, what is needs is that it needs to convert convert the button then it's needs to be so it's sorry sorry it's, it's like just like this and now you need to implement its method so since we are creating the anonymous object with the help of this on click listener so so in order to see what it has what it, just click control and click right click and then it will show you the show you that interface so here you can see it has the abstract method called um, void on click on click now we need to implement this class or we need to override this class inside here so just click on this button and implement methods so it says yes okay now you are good to go so now let me let me let me tell you first of all what these things are so first of all we have we have declared a button variable and then we create uh, then then we create the button instances here and then we and then we set the on click listener on this button and now whenever the button is button is click it is going to run this function and inside this function we have we have 
override this method now we can just type this toast dot make toast get base context and, and then one day so let me type one day I will learn Android okay so just hit right comma and then type specify the length of the toast so I'm going to for the long one and going to show this okay that's it so this is the first method and now let me hit and let me run my Android applications and, and choose next and it is going to load my emulator great our emulator is working and here we go our emulator is running now so Android Studio is installing installing our application and it is also launching our application so we should see a button here and it has the text called Android so it's taking some time yep it has finally loaded our application so now let me try click on this button so and it says one day I will learn Android okay so this is the first method and I will also going to show you this second method how you can apply the button click listener now for the second method um, close this first of all and just comment the comment them so I'm going to comment this method and then I'm going to the activity main dot XML and here I'm, I'm going to add one more attribute on click and then I will going to name this as learning Android okay so this is for here and click save and go to the main activity dot Java file and then you, we need to make one function so it has the public void and then function name learning Android so this is the same function name as, as that of this this one right now it in the in the parameter we need to pass the view object and we can we can type get base context the uh, learn Android and then I specify the toast length so in my case I'm going to press this so so it's done now hit run so and this this the second method is also going to work the uh, work in the same way as that of previous one so it is activity is launching so and if you hit this Android button now it will going to show this one day I will learn Android so this is the second method and there is also one another method and let's try to see that third method as well now for the third method I'm going to comment this function so I have commented out this function and for the third, third method you, we need to set the on set the click listener as a set and type this so it is going to show the error and just type alt enter and just and just select make and able to implement the this on click listener and now hit ok so you can see that now our app compact activity is going to implement this interface on click dot listener at on click dot listener interface and here it has also created one more function for us and inside this function I'm going to have a switch case switch case and then B so this is the object that we have uh, that we have in this function and this get ID and now I need to specify the case so in our case so this case case value will going to have going to be the this ID name uh, it has the end this ID name button we have this so so the button ID has the ID name of button so we are going to have that button name as the order ID dot button and then put semicolon and then just type break 
and we can specify the same toast here as well now done this is done now let's run this application once again and the griddle is building and it has finally loaded our application once again now let me type this button and button call android so you will also going to see the one day i will on android so thank you for watching and this is how you how you implement the button click listener listener in android in three different ways so i will see you in the next part